what has happened everybody um, it's been a little while since I did a video and I just wanted to do something for you and update you uh, on how I'm doing uh, I'm doing good I'm doing real good personally uh, mentally physically I'm doing fucking fantastic um, things are getting better things are getting a lot better um, living arrangements took a turn for the worst um, I am currently living in my car um, I guess completely homeless if you want to say I was living in my garage for a while but I got I had to change plans on living there I couldn't stay there anymore I still got the garage but I can't stay in there anymore um, which sucks but it was getting to a point with my landlord he kept catching he kept catching me going in and out of there and staying there, so instead of getting thrown out of the garage completely, and that would not be a good, that would not be good at all. So I just choose to live in my car. I can't afford anything right now. I can't afford an apartment. Um, can't afford any of that right now. Um, so I'm living in my car. It's not that. It's not bad. Um, it's not too packed in my car. It's not really too packed in. I got my blankets over there, my pillow, laundry. Um, I got total privacy. The windows the windows are tinted 5%, which is limo tint, which you cannot see in the windows at all. Um, I got my car shade, the windshield shade. Um, so I got complete privacy um, in here when I'm parked. Um, that's not a problem at all, which, which is good. Um, I usually park in two different Walmart parking lots. Monday through Friday, I park in one particular Walmart parking lot. And um, Friday nights, Saturdays, and Sundays, I park in another Walmart parking lot overnight. Um, like I said, I got my blankets. I got my pillow. Um, I put the driver's seat, the seat, all the way back and wrap myself up in my blanket. <laughs> And uh, I can actually get a good night's sleep, which is, which, which is amazing um, that I can. But uh, things are good. Things are good. It's not bad. It's not the end of the world. You know, I'm, I'm fortunate for what I have. I thank God for what I have. And I know there's people in this world that, that wishes they had what I have. Um, you know, and it's not much. But, you know, however, however bad you got it, there's always somebody who's got it worse than you. So count your blessings. And be thankful for what you have in life, no matter what it is, no matter how little it is or how how great it is. Be thankful for what you have, because it can all be taken away from you in a, in a heartbeat, that fast. So, be thankful for what you have in life, and I am. Trust me. Um, hopefully, I will be back in an apartment again. I'm really hoping about the end of February to middle to the end of February of next year uh, I'm really hoping to be back in my own place uh, maybe like a small studio apartment or possibly a one bedroom if it's cheap enough um, but that's something I'm shooting for next year uh, after I got my tax return which is about the middle of February um, I'm gonna hammer down and look for an apartment and I have complete utmost confidence that I will find one and I'll be able to afford it and I'll be back living in an apartment again. Uh, so it's just something for me to shoot for. Kind of a goal to shoot for next year. My number one goal, actually. Um, BMX. Here in northern New Jersey, the weather is completely unpredictable in the winters. And New Jersey winters can be absolutely the most fierce winter you can possibly imagine. Um, and on the other hand, it could be a mild winter. You never know. Um, but I typically stop riding through the winter because I don't have we I don't have any indoor uh, bike parks local like right near me that I can travel to and ride. I know there's ones kind of out of Jersey and maybe two three hours from me. I'm not driving two or three hours to go ride. Um, so I just typically stop riding through the whole winter. Um, that works for me because right now my life is kind of 
on the rocks, so to speak. So I can take this time and just kind of take care of myself. I'm not really worried about riding BMX right now. Next year, springtime, I will hammer down um, Bloomfield Skate Park every Sunday mornings. And I will get back to riding a lot more. Back to my happy place. And uh, things will be good. I'll be in my own apartment. Um, a little money in the bank. Big smile on my face. And, uh, and on my BMX. So, but yeah, I'm doing good. Two things in my life right now, two big things in my life that actually 100% literally saved my life is therapy and the gym. Two things that literally saved my life. Um, I absolutely believe that my life will be good. I'm a good person and my life will get better and better progressively each day. Um, and things are good with me right now. Things are really good. Um, living arrangements is the only thing in my life that I'm not really stressing about. You know, I can get a good night's sleep right here in the car. You know, so I'm not, I'm not that worried about that. I'll do what I got to do to survive. And I've always been like that. I'm a survivalist. Um, I do what I have to do to survive and I, and I do it, do whatever you got to do. So anyway, that's about it. I just wanted to update you guys. I'm doing good. Things are awesome. So anyway, peace, love, and happiness, and see you guys later.